All right, what is going on everyone? In this video, I'm going to show you a pretty cool uh, alternative to Keeper, all right? So this is completely free. You know, back in the day, it's probably like four to six months ago, maybe now that Keeper actually changed uh, their system and they're actually charging for their platform now. However, this, the one I'm gonna show you today is Salisbrite, okay? So if you've watched a few of my videos before, you would have seen me talk about uh, Salisbrite before. Uh, this is completely free, um, part of their Chrome extension that they offer and it, yeah it's pretty cool so I'll just jump into it and show you so this is just a random product uh, I was looking at on Amazon so if you come down this is what it looks like right here okay so you can see you can see the price history you can see the BSR history you can see uh, the reviews um, history and also the uh, the review ratings as well. So yeah, you can come down here, you can change the time frame and whatnot, and you can play around with it. Yeah, and this, like I said, this is completely free. It's um it is yeah a pretty handy tool. So yeah, back in the day, I used to use Keeper quite a lot. Um, but yeah, the, but then I signed up for Seller Sprite anyway. And within Seller Sprite, if you decide that you do actually sign up and you want to become a paying user, then yeah, there's a lot more data inside as well. You can dive a lot deeper, which is yeah, it's pretty cool. So I'll leave the this, uh, what do you call it, the the link in the description below. And yeah, if you d do decide that you want to go deeper into your product research and you want to use Seller Sprite, um, yeah, I'll leave a uh, discount code down there as well, which gets you 20% off uh, each month. And uh, yeah, so that is about it. So as I said, it's uh, yeah, completely free with this function. Uh, check it out, give it a try, and yeah, let me know what you think in the comments below. All right, that's it for this video, and yeah, I'll see you in another one.